Hi guys, Alan with Slaps Audio here. Uh, we finally got our bench test uh, up and running. Um, what we have, we have uh, eight dummy loads here. Each one is an eight ohm load wired in parallel. So the amplifier should see about a one ohm load. Um, powering our bench are two 100 amp hour lithium ion phosphate RV batteries. Uh, capable of 200 amps continuous and 400 amps of five second burst output. Um, that's why we're only doing our Shock 3K um, with the power supply we have right now. Um, Shock 3K is the only amplifier that's kind of in range that these batteries can handle. Um, and what we have for the dyno test, we have the SPL Lab Next LCD. Let's get this reset here. And we have a regular multimeter. We are clamped on. Mind the wiring mess, guys. We literally just got this uh, up and running, so we wanted to do a test on to show what our amplifiers do. So we are going to run a tone through the amplifier and see what we come up with. All right, not sure what the voltage dropped to. Probably mid-11s. Uh, the next LCD at a 1.5 ohm, that's what that 1.5 R is, 2,986 watts from our uh, Slaps Shock 3K. Running off of strictly battery power, only have a little 20 amp power supply charging uh, these batteries. Um, we're a new company. Um, we know a lot of people out there saying that our amplifiers don't do rated power. You know, we're not comparable to other full bridge amplifiers out there um, because of our price. Um, we've done a ton of R&D guys on different manufacturers, even Brazilian uh, manufacturers. And our Shock 3K, 5K, and AK are the amplifiers that we came up with. Um, We had the manufacturer make a little tweaks and changes to the amplifiers for us, but in all our testing, um, our, our amplifiers, we feel, um, are the best out there for a full bridge and obviously our price. Um, we want to be a little bit below market so we can give a good product to people um, at a fair price. Again, at a 1.5 ohm, 2,986 watts. Thanks for watching, guys, and keep on slapping.